So I have this capture, it's also made by Munsell, and I thought it'd be fun to compare the colors that I got with my book outside in the field with these colors that you get with using this electronic reader. So I've brought my samples into my house because I thought the sound might be a little better without the wind. And I've got moist samples and I'm ready to go ahead and scan them. So the way you do that is you just take this and open the window place it on top of your soil and it's got its own light source inside so that's why it's okay to be under a different light source than where we were outside and they just hold the side button and use it to see what it says uh, it says 10 yr 2 1 so I'm going to write that down and at the end I'll compare what the book says with what my answers say on my sheet so 10 yr 2 1 for the first horizon for the second horizon let me get a big enough piece here and Place it here on the table and give it a shot. This says 5Y21 and I just want to make sure that I had it on a big enough piece here. So get a little bit more out here. Make sure I've got plenty there where the reader goes. Okay, that says 10YR21 again. And it actually says color picker. So it's also saying that there's some 5Y 2.51 in there as well. So let's see, 5.Y 5Y 2.51, N 0.75 slash, and two and a half, 10 wire 2 1. Okay, so I'm gonna go ahead and just use the 10 wire 2 1. That's sort of the simplest answer there. And then let's see, I've got the third horizon here. Now this horizon does have clay films, so we'll see how it does here. Um, it's always a little tricky to me. It says 5YR, well, here it's got two colors. 5YR 2.52 and 5P 2.4. So I wonder if that's picking up some color off the table or something, that sounds a little strange. Let's try this again. So that's 7.5YR32, which is probably more in the realm of, you know, a normal color I would choose. Okay, now the, actually looks like that came from a different horizon. So I'm going to get some of this gathered up here on the fourth horizon. Put that on the table. Let's see what we get. This says 10 Y, oh, okay, oh, it's got four different colors. Let's see what it's saying here. Seven and a half Y R three, two, five G Y two, two. Oops, I'm gonna get back off that screen. Uh, let's see, I better just rescan that because that seems weird. Okay, try that. Okay, that says 5YR, oh, two colors, 10YR32, and the other one is N1 slash. So, you know, the blackest chicken, blackest chip in the book. So, I wouldn't, like I said, I, I'm not too surprised because this is pretty loaded up with clay films. And so, might be, I could see where potentially get some different different color choices there. Okay, after all of that, now we get 7.5 YR32, which is what the one above it was, and I'm pretty comfortable with that as a potential color choice. So let's do one more scan here. 5Y21. So you can see it, it just kind of depends how it lands on a given piece, I'd say. Um, so those are pretty multicolored. Now let's look at this last horizon, and I do have a decent chunk of this um, here. So let's use this piece. It's a pretty good piece. Okay, so 7.5YR34. And I want to break this open and just see what happens if I look around at some other color options here. See if it gives me any others. 2.5YR34, 
Let's see. Five way or three four. So the three four sounds like it's pretty set on that. But find one more spot. That's five way or three three on that piece. Two point five way or three three. So how did the, the capture and I do? And here I'll say that on my sheet, this pink sheet, there are some scribbles because of the fact that I, you know, scanned the piece a few different times. I got a few different answers, and so I picked the one that you know seemed the most reasonable. I would say the capture and I are consistently off a little bit from each other. So what I mean is for the top two horizons, I chose 10YR31 and it selected 10YR21. So off a chip for both of those. And then for the next two horizons, I chose 10YR43 and it chose 7.5YR32. So that's off a page and off about two chips, I think. And then for the four, fifth horizon, it uh, I chose 7.5YR44 and it chose seven and a half y r three four. So, um, you know, as far as the capture goes, I would say my feelings are, I, I break it out when sometimes I wanna check myself, but um, it, I think it might be useful sometimes for if you had a very highly modeled piece and you could use that color picker, so scan and get both of those colors into one picture, I think that would be pretty interesting. Um, but I think for the most part, I feel pretty good about just going ahead and using the color book. So that's my review of the capture.